It's cotton candy cloud Hey Divas, so in today's video I'm here to share with you guys this unit that I am rocking right now So if you guys are interested then definitely keep on watching Okay Divas, so jumping right in today we have a unit by Sensational from the What Lace Collection I have her in the style Letitia in the color number 1B So here's how she looks, she does come with a nice kinky texture And she comes with luscious bouncy curls And here's the cap construction, she is small head friendly girl So if your head is swole like mine and big like mine, it's small head so it comes with two combs in the front as well as a comb in the back with the adjustable straps. And here's the parting space, which I kind of feel like this is like a 13 by four and a half or five. And here's the hairline. This hairline is a lot more dense than um, the rest of them. I know in the in the ending of this video, I said the hairline is nice, but I just noticed looking at this, like it is kind of like dense. But anyways, um, that's how the hair falls on me, and I am 5'2", in case you want to know and use that as a reference, and I do have a shorter neck. Now, of course, we are going to get shedding and tangling with this unit, okay, because it's it's curled, it's synthetic fiber, as well as a kinky texture. However, you can gain control with some wig control spray and a paddle brush or a wide tooth comb, and that's what I'm going to do here. But yeah, I'll let you guys just go ahead and watch and I'll finish out with my closing thoughts. So the only thing I forgot to say in my closing thoughts was that the hairline is more dense than the rest of them. So I kind of didn't appreciate that because I love the hairline on the rest of them. But um, yeah, I'll let you guys go ahead and watch. And of course, I'll finish out with my closing thoughts. Okay Divas, so now that you guys have gotten all the details and the specs on this hair, I am here to tell you guys how I feel about it, so let's just jump right in. Okay, so we are going to go ahead and jump right into the pros and the cons, okay? So first of all, I was super excited to get this hair because I noticed that it was a texture unit, hence to why I got a natural color. I feel like the texture units look best in a natural color. They definitely could look cute and slay other colors, but for me, like it's a one or one b type of situation when it's a natural like texture okay but anyways these curls are absolutely gorgeous that was like one of the things that really really made me excited to receive this unit like i was just like curls volume you guys know and if you don't know girl i live for some volume okay and that is exactly what i am serving to you right now okay sensational really did their thing when it came to the curls and the volume and everything like that but um yeah so i really really do love the style of this unit it's really really nice it's pretty much the same as the um other what lace uh units so one of the things I did notice that's a plus about this unit is that the lace was not as starky like white as the other ones was oh girl what is going on my lash okay so i got it together so one of the things i did notice i'm sorry you guys um is that the light the lace was not that light however i did still have to tint it because i am a chocolatey girl okay so you know if you chocolate it's just something we should be used to by now but however i did appreciate the fact that the lace was not super starky white so i did not have to put in like that much work to go ahead and get it to work for me so yeah um i really really do love these curls the volume um, the cap construction is pretty much the same as what lace unit except for one thing which is my one con with this unit but overall like it's really nice as you guys can see the parting space I know my middle part is not that straight girl it's late but I wanted to get this video done so don't even try me but yeah like the parting space and the hairline is really really nice now it is dense on this like on the edges it is kind of dense um so as far as like if you were to lay this lid to, to lay this wig and you wanted to like put it up or something you might have to put the size because it is a little bit more dense in that area so keep that in mind 
Uh, as for me, I most of the time don't style my wigs like that, but if that's something that you're interested in, then you definitely need to keep that in mind. Now let's go ahead and talk about my con. The con that I have with this unit is that, girl, it's too small for me. It's too small for me. So for all the big head, the swole head girls out there like me, girl, it's going to be too small for us. But as you can see, I am still working it, okay? So here's how it looks on the sides. And that's why I didn't lay it down because it is like behind, you know, it's falling behind the hairline. I know you can't really tell, girl, because I shaved my edges. But let me show you this side because they kind of already grew back already. <laughs> but so as you guys can see, it is behind my hairline. So... It does not completely fit. However, you still can make it work. Like, as you guys can see, like, she still look, okay? But you have to keep that in mind. You are not going to be able to lay her all, you know, like, lay her all down all across and style her up and stuff if you have a swollen head like me all the time, okay? So, that's something to keep in mind. But other than that, I am totally here for this unit. Now, as per usual, you are going to experience some shedding and tangling because first of all this is a synthetic fiber unit and second of all uh is curls and it's you know it's a kinky texture so you're you know you're just you're gonna experience that but it's nothing that is too excessive as you guys can see i am here she is sitting looking fabulous okay she is laid so i really do like that um oh yeah it was one more thing that i didn't like so when it comes it, she has some humpage okay and i did not want to put a hot comb on her because as you guys can see she has a very beautiful texture a very beautiful luster and i don't want to disturb that so i did have to go in with like some holding spray my wig control spray and my blow dryer which was not a problem but she did have hump action and that may be a con for some of my divas out there who want to just you know throw in their unit in the powder and cut the lace and go okay so that was another con that i had but however it's something that could be fixed it's nothing major but i don't know i just i don't like when wigs have hump action it's just it's kind of annoying yeah, overall i think that she is fabulous would i recommend her um definitely her price point is definitely up there though girl okay her price point is bougie <laughs> Um, she is nearly $60 and I know that, you know, that's, that's, that's a bit much, okay? Because some of these units are a lot less than that and some people may say like, oh, well, I can get a unit that has a kinky texture that's a little less than that, but I don't know. For me, what she brings to the table is this what lace type of, the lace, that's what she brings and she also has like beautiful texture um curls and it is soft so i feel like she has pros but i know i will understand if this the price point is kind of up there because she's hitting that like she's like 56 it up okay on other sites so um it just depends on what site you go to but yeah she is hitting up there so i don't know but I would definitely say to put her in your wig arsenal if you are looking for something that's like really, really beautiful and textured and full like this. Like, cause she is just really serving me everything that I need besides the fact that she's too small. So I would definitely recommend her. And if you guys are interested, I will definitely have a link down in the description box below. So be sure to go ahead and check that out. But yeah, Divas, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. If you fabulous girls did enjoy this video and find it very helpful and easy to follow, then definitely go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Be sure to leave me a comment down below. I would love to hear from you fabulous divas. Know what you guys are thinking. Are you going to get this wig? What do you think of this wig on your girl? Just talk to me. I would love to hear from you fabulous divas. And be sure to go ahead and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And also hit that notification bell, girl. I do upload quite often. And you definitely do not want to miss any of my videos. But yeah, divas, thank you guys so, so much for watching. And I'll see you fabulous ladies in my next video. Bye.